We all have wonderful memories of our first playthroughs of the Souls games, and the biggest factor in deciding how we play these games is the weapons that we choose. Here's the main weapon that I used in all my first playthroughs of the Souls games. The Zweihander in Dark Souls Remastered feels too good at times. The light attack covers a huge area in front of you. The heavy overhand swing is sure to stun any enemy. On top of this, the lightning infusion that I had made this weapon even more broken. Luckily, my PS5 even recorded my first pinwheel fight with it, and I was in a party with friends at the time. Here's how he stood up to my lightning Zweihander. Oh my god. <laughs> He's done already, what? <laughs> oh my god. He said he was a hard boss. For almost the entire run of Dark Souls 2, I used a plus 10 bastard sword with high ADP and high HP. This is the one I regret using the most. Maybe it's the weapon moveset? Maybe it was the game? All I know is that I uninstalled this game the second I beat it. Honestly, I'd rather beg my friends for money than use this weapon again. And I'm willing to put my money where my mouth is. Hello? Hey, oh man, you got a dollar? Goodbye, Tom. <laughs> The Uchigatana is an absolute gem of a weapon. The fast move set, the bleed buildup, and the ability to parry make it amongst the best in the series. I wouldn't have it any other way for my first playthrough of Dark Souls 3. Just thinking about it makes me want to go through the entire DLC so I can fight Gale again. Which I did, of course. The Saw Cleaver is the first weapon I used, and definitely my favorite starting weapon. I made sure to recommend this one to my sister when we started our first co-op playthrough of the game. What, does it say my name, or does it say the Jersey side? It says Cooperator, the Jersey side. Cooperator? Yeah. <laughs> I don't necessarily regret using the Saw Cleaver, but if I had to do it over again, I would absolutely use the Whirly Gig Saw. Wow, the pizza cutter is so strong, and it's incredibly iconic. The first weapon I think of when I think of Bloodborne has got to be this thing. I have done the standard ending to Elden Ring once, the Frenzied Flame ending once, and Ronnie's ending a total of 48 times. With that in mind, the Dark Moon Greatsword is by far my favorite weapon. The magic damage and frostbite buildup make chopping through enemies the old-fashioned way a breeze. However, the highlight of this beast is the weapon art. The damage to health and poise done by that magical wave still leaves me in awe. Also, the fact that this weapon gets buffed every other patch makes it even harder to ignore. The quality of this weapon and the connection to Rani make it easily my favorite first playthrough weapon. Accounting for that and its legacy throughout the entire series probably makes it my favorite weapon out of all of them. <laughs>